was your what was your first LeBron playing against LeBron experience like? I'm trying to think about this. Because I didn't play. There was a lot of DMPs my first year. So I'm trying to remember for sure if my first game against them was a DMP. My first game against them was a DMP in LA. So the next time I played against them was the time where they were trying to make that playoff push, play and push my rookie year. And uh, we were down by 20 at, at half. And I came in and I think I scored like 18 in the third quarter. I remember that game. Yeah. yeah. That was one of the games where I actually started to feel comfortable and like, all right, I belong here because I definitely came along a lot later in my rookie year. And, you know, it was a pretty great, it was a pretty cool experience going against LeBron and, you know, almost putting them out of their, you know, playing, not exactly, but pushing them, setting them back a little bit. And mainly because I was a Kobe guy growing up. So that's, that's one other reason. And you couldn't. It's. You're, you're, it's I feel like the, you live in a very black and white world. Yes, you do. <laughs> yeah, you no do. Great, Maybe no it's because of the way you were raised with this Duke UNC thing. It's okay to like both. No. Oh, absolutely not. <laughs> absolutely. Learn could, to love the gray. All I right. Could, I couldn't live in my house if I like Duke. <laughs> so no, but no, it was really cool. And then, um, you know, after the game, it was my mom's birthday, and my mom loves LeBron. And you know, I asked him. I was like can you take a picture of my mom? It's her birthday. And he was very nice to take a picture with her for her birthday. And I was very appreciative of that because I understand, like, after a loss, a lot of guys are, you know, not very good people, which I'm not either. But, like, yeah, it's for my mom. So I was appreciative of that. I love that.